my date with him tonight? <laughs> I'm getting married. I am so sorry. I had no idea he was so You know sweet. what, Tonya? I'm tired of you. I'm tired of your wacky stories about your family. I'm even tired of those braids. They need a touch-up. <laughs> you can tell? Leave me alone. <laughs> oh, come on, Mary. You can't mean that. I'm your friend. You know what? I'm not so sure about that anymore. <laughs> Yeah, but I like this place, Tiffany. I'm gonna take you to my hangout sometime. Okay. The power plant. Oh, is that that new club downtown? No, no, no. It's where they generate electricity. It's a real power plant. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see what's taking them so long with these coffees. All right. Yes, probably the 40 watt lighting. A good party. <laughs> oh, the party was off the hook. The campus police came and broke the party up, but not before I got this female's phone number. Carl, she gave you the number for the weather lady. What? <laughs> I thought she had a strange outgoing message. <laughs> anyway, it's a good thing you did not bring Mark. He would have been in way over his head. No. Oh, really? Mark. Oh, hey, babe. This is this is uh, these are my friends, Raynell and Carl. Uh, your friends from college. Uh-huh. Yeah, and Raynell here majors in big mouthology. <laughs> now, I thought you said you didn't have anything to do tonight. Well, uh, after I told you that bullface lie, I was pretty much free. <laughs> <laughs> Tiffany, I don't mind so much that you didn't want to take me to your party. But why'd you have to lie? Mark, listen. I, I really don't even want to hear it. Why? Because you're too pretty. Face like that make a brother weak. <laughs> Well, how about if I turn around while I talk? You obviously don't know how good you look from the back. Um, how's this? All right. Good. Mark, listen, I am really sorry. I wanted to bring you to the party, but uh, I just thought you'd be uncomfortable there. And what would make you think that? Because I just... I, I guess I thought you wouldn't have much in common with my friends. Because I'm an electrician. Because I didn't go to college, Tiffany, none of that matters. I like people. People like me. I fit in anywhere I go because I like me. Obviously, you don't. Yes, I do. Listen. Look, let's just... Let's just start over, okay? I don't know. Come on, Mark, please. Come on. I see you playing dirty. <laughs> All right. Let's start over. Good. Can you forgive me? Tiffany. Uh, hey, big round. What are you doing? You mind? Could you get us a couple of lattes? My girl and I have a lot of catching up to do. <laughs> I I'll be there in a few minutes. Now, don't worry. I'm on the freeway cruising at 90, and there's no one in front of me and no one behind. Oh! <laughs> okay, honey, a, a minor delay. But I've talked my way out of many tickets. Oh, hi, officer. Um, look, I'm a doctor on my way to the hospital. But I think my friend, President Grant, can say this. <laughs> Don't wait up. Father Sullivan, what's all this? Did I get fired? No, no, I, I thought this was a new crew. I don't have a crew. Well, these imaginary men are almost done. <laughs> well, where do all these guys come from? I called every single person you've ever helped. Every charity you donated time to, and every organization you ever supported. And they all came to help you, Mary. Aww. And I even got some of my cousins to help out. See, my whole family ain't crazy. Uh, which one is he? <laughs> I'm guessing. The one trapped inside the drywall. <laughs> Marion, don't you have something to say to your friend? Um, Tonya, I forgive you. Marion. Mm. Marion, 
And you know what? Hmm. The next time I pay our mortgage, I'll be sure to do it in person and get a receipt. <laughs> Next time I let you handle my money, Father Sullivan here will be fighting Evander Holyfield for the heavyweight title. Yeah, and I can take him too, even if I have to bite his ear off. Get out! Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Hey, I appreciate it. I won't forget it, man. Thank you. Well, Father, looks like things are going to work out after all. Thanks for the check. I'm going to give this money to Eddie and get him out of my life forever. Good show, Marion. Thank Good you, Father. Show. Thank you. Yeah. Appreciate this. Heard you wanted to talk to me, man. Yeah, I got your damn money. Take it. You know what that check says? It says you're paid in full, I don't owe you anything, and you're the same loser that you've always been. <laughs> What's up, Eddie? What's up, big man? <laughs> ah, my man. What's up, Blake? I'm cool. What's wrong? Oh, man, look, the drum machine, I forgot. I got so caught up in the job, it slipped my mind. I'm sorry. I lost my gig, Marion. All my friends are laughing at me. It was talking about responsibility. Look what you did. Hmm. But don't worry about me. I got another hookup. Who? Me. See, you got your people with you, but I got my little homie here. He doesn't need anything from you, Eddie. Blake, don't get involved with him. You know he what, Marion? Just leave me alone. You're not going to do not this, now. Eddie. Not now, Marion. Not now. Yeah, Marion. Not now. <laughs> yeah, but this is far from over. <laughs>